Assalamu alaikum everyone this is Saida and welcome to my channel if you are new here then please subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon today i am going to explain a very short and easy summary of Shahrazad's golden leopard by our famous writer Muniza Shamsi so without wasting any further time let's get started Shahrazad's golden leopard is an emotional piece of writing by Muniza Shamsi it is a story based on complete absence of trust mutual understanding and genuine care between a mother and her daughter. In the very beginning of the story, it is revealed that Shahrazad longed to please her mother throughout the story by either trying to wear clothes by herself or getting a promotion in her class. Shahrazad follows her mother's orders and does as she is told even if she hates it. She longs for the motherly affection and care that is expected in the relationship. Her mother scolds her ruthlessly in public for every mistake or error that Shahrazad makes. For example, you're such a stupid, stupid girl are the words of her mother. She would shout at her without a thought of the impact it would make on the little girl's mind. The mother praises her son more than her daughter and openly declares her partiality. She expresses her dislike for Shahrazad's lack of proper friends and even goes to display doubt on her daughter being mentally sound. She shows no concern on the nickname that Malcolm has for her daughter. The continuous chant of Fatima adds to Shahrazad's inferiority complex and her confidence drops drastically. She feels isolated from her family and believes that there is no one who understands her or gives her importance. There are several moments where Shahrazad is scolded and made a fool in front of other people by her own mother. The fact that Shahrazad comes top of her class is of no significance to the mother, as it means she only remains buried in her books and doesn't play with other children. Shahrazad is a symbol of shame and disgust for the mother and this is revealed throughout the story. The leopard in the story is a symbol of passion for Shahrazad. It is a symbol of something she can look up to and feel hopeful for. Since her mother has let her down time and again, she feels that everything bad that happens in her life will go away if she finally gets a chance to play with the leopard. The leopard was something she owned all by herself and it had no share in anyone else's life. It was her one possession she was proud of that made her feel worthy and confident. The leopard exuded self-esteem and self-worth for Shahrazad. He could read her thoughts, he understood her every word and he had the power to take away her pain. The golden leopard was her source of confidence and of satisfaction. What the people in her life failed to give her was provided to her by the leopard. Her mother's constant criticism slowly chipped away parts of her self-esteem. She even keeps the leopard away from her on the pretense that she is too young to play with it. More than once, Mehru fails to support her daughter. She prefers to demean her own child than exhibit some faith in her. Shahrazad is let down by her mother repeatedly in the story and this repetition of mistrust and lack of support creates a massive rift between the mother and child. We also see in the story that Shahrazad had been left behind with Kishwari Bua for being a naughty girl and a liar. Shah Rukh, her brother, had been taken out for a drive. The mere memory brought tears to Shahrazad's eyes. She always hated Malcolm and his parties. To add fuel to fire, Shahrazad's mother gives away her most beloved and prized possession, the leopard, to Malcolm as a birthday gift. The mere act in itself breaks Shahrazad's spirit and her heart. You can't have him, she wanted to cry. You can't have him, he is mine. The feeling of abandonment and isolation made her feel miserable. Her mother failed to understand the importance of the leopard in Shahrazad's life even when she voiced it. Even her nightmares are imbued with the loss of her prized item and Malcolm's cruelty. In her isolation, she creates an imaginary friendship with the leopard that was no longer hers and held long conversations in solitude with it. She even looked forward to visiting Malcolm for the sake of seeing the leopard. Her extreme obsession with the toy leads to an immense feeling of absolute loss when she realizes that Malcolm and his friends broke the leopard during a game. His tail was broken, his luminous eyes had been pulled out. There was a slit down the center of his stomach, straw and stuffing were hanging out. Oh, her leopard had been murdered. 
The shock that Sherazad feels on the loss of one good thing from her life drives her to extremities. Since her whole being relied on the ecstatic utopia that the leopard created for her, the loss drives her into action. She wanted to punish Malcolm for being the reason of the loss of the one thing that she loved in her life. All the anger that was building up inside of her because of her mother's attitude and injustice came crashing out on Malcolm. She attacked Malcolm and hurt him badly. In this way, Muniza Shamsi ends the story and shows that the mother is responsible for instigating negative and dangerous feelings in her daughter's mind. Sherazad's extreme obsession with the leopard and detachment with the human figures in her life should have been checked by her mother. The complete lack of trust and understanding between the mother and daughter led to a dangerous and extreme end. Here our video also comes to an end. If you want another video on how colonialism is related to the story of Shahrazad's golden leopard, then do tell me in the comment section below. Thank you so much for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe my channel. See you in my next video. Bye-bye.